Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. This is the episode where we are filling up our muffalos and getting ready for a trip. But Mohawk here has got a problem. Mohawk is starving, and Mohawk seems to be broken. Mohawk wants to haul silver, doesn't want to eat, is middle stage pregnant, malnourished, and is going to lose the, the puppies, and there's not a thing I can do about it. Mohawk seems to be uh, seems to be a little broken. So I don't oh right there miscarried due to starvation. Yep, now probably going to be really sad. Of course, needs doesn't really reflect it with the animals, but malnutrition is a problem, and there is nothing that I can think of doing. Anesthetize. Hmm. Otherwise, this. Yeah, there's no choosing what you get to eat or not. Mohawk is consuming kibble. Now it works. See, Mohawk has been in the dog area the entire time, always had access to food, including all this meat up in here. So I just don't get what was going on there. I don't know. This happened to us once before, one of the other dogs. Some random little glitch or something. Anyway, we're starting to get ready for our trip. And we don't seem to be able to do anything until all of the animals arrive. Uh, Monk is bringing some steel. Where'd that steel come from? You came from in here. Oh, right in there, there's steel. Okay, that's where um, Miss P was working. <laughs> there's Manuela and her war mask. <laughs> and so we're waiting for for big furry uh, um, carpets to, to walk into here. Otherwise, we're just going to wander back and forth and think about things. We need to wait for three Muffalo to arrive. Muffalo, there's the last one. So when Muffalo 3 shows up, I think we're going to start the process of going crazy toward loading up pemmican. And then we got, what, medicines? We've got some silver. We've got... Oh, a few regular meals, we've got seven sleeping bags, and we've got um, some hay, and some statues, just in case we hit a trader. But I was wondering if I could go through and add more things to it if I chose to. I went to World Map Generating Planet, and I found that I could create another caravan, and everything has been taken out of the inventory and put into the first caravan will not show up on the list which we will see in about 10 minutes oh there we go <laughs> so i can form a caravan and the seven that are going are not here anymore including the three muffalo that are are not here anymore so um i can create a second caravan but world if i want to delete this caravan i could cancel forming caravan terminates the caravan formation process and it shuts down for everyone but I can't go in and edit anything that I'm aware of I don't see any way to do that so I'm I know one of the things one of the goals for update 1.0 was to wait I think Titan ordered it fix the uh, fix the, the the world the, the travel system it just wasn't satisfied with the way it was built the way it was designed so I assume that 1.0 is going to do it quite differently that was, that was a lot of discussion there for a while. Um, so I don't see any way that I could modify this as I want. And I see they all just got the order to go get pemmican. And boy, they are doing it. <laughs> all these little piles of mm, pemmican. Yeah. Mm -mm. So that's going on. Let's get kind of a roll call. Handy needs. You're going to need food here before long. Miss a P, you're doing okay. Sea Stars was the worry. Sea Stars is gathering... They all have to slowly walk through the generators. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to keep track of the food. The rest is not much I can do with. They're just going to, you know, crash right here on the floor somewhere and go to sleep, probably. I can't get them to their bed. Do you still have a bed? I wonder if that takes you out of the colony. Nope, still owner Sea Stars. Okay, that still worked. Hmm... Okay, well, let's get the the last of the pemmican loaded. I think we brought it all. Yeah, we're good there. 
And so let's see, stars, how you doing now? Needs. Let's hit you hit, hit that line. I'll tell you what, let's go get a meal now. Before you hit that line, you may just crash on me. So go ahead and get a meal. And we're looking at handy. You do the same thing. Um, actually, I need better. It'd be better if I shift clicked and did that. Rabbits, you're going. And we've got that right there. You need some too. Come on over. And Shantigo, you're going. So, sure, let's get everybody at least one of your bars up there. Klaus is not going. Sangria is not. Um, next one is Missa P. And sure, let's get you loaded up as well. And then there was Alicia. Yeah, and you could use a meal too. Then there was Sea Stars. You're already. And then there was Oath Knight. And you need one as well. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, that's everyone. So everyone's going to grab a meal after we get done loading all this stuff up. And at least we'll have one of our two most important bars maxed out for hopefully enough time to get the rest of it done. But I don't know what happens when they run out of sleep. They may, we may just see a lot of Z's right here in the dining room. <laughs> yeah, nothing like... Uh, Starting a trip all all cranked out. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, what's going on? I, you know, it'd be nice if we had at least had a roof over here. Zone, uh, build roof. Somebody I'm sure is able to go and put that in for us. But yeah, make that a little bit nicer. There's some milk right there. Who milked a cow right there? Uh, I guess one of them needed it, and Sangria came by right there. Uh huh. Yeah. Up oh, there goes Sea Stars. She's out. Sleeping on the floor. So, your needs... I think you hit that line and you dropped. And now you're starting to build up again. At least you got your meal in in time. Okay, that worked out pretty good. Um, seemed like Handy was real close to that same point. Where are you in this blur? Let's go this route. You're over here right now. And needs... You're not there yet, Rabbit is not us food handy rest down here okay Shantigo you're okay so maybe it was now well, Miss P is going to be the next one to drop Alicia's kind of okay and Sea Stars is getting better and Oath Knight you're right there so if we can we got food in everyone I, I did actually look at the food bars looking at the other ones did everybody obey those orders we got food there we've got Sea Stars did Alicia did, Miss B did, not. Where are you at? You're over here. You are gonna. Oh, you took the long way to go get 75 hay. Okay, that's what's up. And what's the noise? Somebody's digging or building something. Minor break is Faith, who is out here in the rain planting. Uh, ugly environment, you are going to go play horseshoes. It is 20 hundred. Let's switch you over to watching TV right there. That'll give you the biggest boost. Otherwise, we start at 10 in the morning. We're at 8 o'clock at night, and we're still filling up. So, hmm. If I could get the sense of when the last of the stuff is going to be loaded, I could wake Sea Stars up. Spee's getting her meal. And she is ready to fall asleep somewhere out in the rain. What do you want to bet? She's gathering supplies. I wish you told me what she was gathering. I don't even see a line. That's Faith again. That is your line there. You're heading for a sleeping bag. So we got one, two sleeping bags left. Let's check our, our loads over here. We've got Muffalo 3 with one, two sculptures, a, a cloth bed roll, some pemmican, some hay. We've got Merat with more pemmican, two more statues. We've got uh, Muffalo 3. You're the one I was already on. So there we go. we got some herbal medicine, regular medicine, uh, all the silver. So we're looking pretty good there. Really, it's hay we're waiting for now. Um, Alpaca, you got some hay. Clyde, you don't. you got the meals. Okay, hopefully we can get them to eat those meals first before they go bad. Miss Pete, where did you ever go you just fell asleep but at least you're under a roof you're okay are you cold you're just a whole bunch of disturbed sleep oh great ah, 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 ah. 
Yeah, let's get you to that line where we're going to wake you up. Um, sea stars disturb sleep times four. Let's give you something to do to get you up. Let's not stack any more disturbed sleeps against you. What to do? Get you another meal? Um, can I get you to, to clean one spot? Of, that could work. So you've got prioritized work and you've got forming a caravan. Okay, so that got you up. And with, with only four disturbed sleeps. Actually, it's only a negative six, so that helped out. You can help over there. Is everybody else done? I think they'd all be wandering here if they were. And he's bringing more hay. Where's all this hay coming from? You guys always seem to be coming from over here. Are you really raiding the hay, the little bit of hay we have over there? No, you're all raiding this one. And does it matter? You're going... You're just grabbing... Can we, oh, I see. That's kind of the closest point. I see. We gotta grab from there. So, we got 200 hay right here. Can we just steal that? That would be nice. More of these are going in. Okay, Miss Pete needs, as soon as you get past that little mark there, disturb sleep times three. Let's stop you right in. Boy, don't do it that way. Um, I think we're about ready. Gotta be close. Sea stars, you are at that point. Let's try to get Miss P. Let's walk through this again. All right, so Rabbit's at that line. Alicia's below that line. Oath Knight is below that line. Uh, sea stars, Miss P. Shantigo, you're right at that line. Handy, you're below that line. So Miss P, where are you? You're right there. Let's give you something to do. What is there for you to do? Um, let's have you just fill up this generator. That'll get you up real quick task. You don't have to walk very far. And the last of you can bring in the uh, the hay, and I think we'll get started. Both knights not going to do anything more. That must have been the last of it. Any kind of a pop-up? Who's left? We're missing Handy. She's getting probably the last gathering supplies. No, you're going back for more. Oath knight, you are wandering. So I think... When Alicia finishes, we're ready to go. If we can just do that before whoever was the lowest hits that line, we'll be good. Right? I hope so. David, you are hauling steel to improvise steel turret. So the rest of you guys are just going to keep building a uh, uh, building a base. Yeah. So we're good on traps. So we're defended. We are. Okay. Uh, we could finish building walls over here. That'd be nice. Uh, finish off just little touches here and there. Wouldn't hurt to just kind of clean up all the little details. We still have a few rooms left to... That's uh, right, we still have Bill's room to finish up. We, we did get the door going. Okay, let's call that good enough. Oh, I already did switch you over. It must have done in between episodes. I thought about it, but I didn't know that I had done it. So this room is officially available again. So in case anybody wants to uh, swap out for a room with red carpet, you know, let me know. That's we can do this. That room's available. I hate to waste the carpet, um, but we do have. Well, let's get where I can see what's going on. Sea stars, you're gathering supplies too. Rabbit, you are too. How come you guys kind of pause there for a while? Oath Knight, you're still wandering. Alicia, you got your stuff back, but you guys are still figuring it out. Oh, it's going to be close before they all start to sleep again on me. Um, what was I saying? Cotton. Where is that listed? Right there. Cotton is now 300. Still not that much. Okay. So we got the one load in. So I guess we just have to wait for this whole thing to happen here. So when this happens, when everything starts to pop and we harvest it, if anybody wants a particular color for their bedroom and you know, for carpeting, let me know. We can go that route. Wild Boar is giving birth. Right over there, we now have Wild Boar 104. And did we? We did not. Sangria is in bed. I might be able to get her to train that squirrel one more time. Um, otherwise, Wild Boars, you two go over there. That's all done. I need you two trained. Seem to be good there. Pause. And let's take another look at our peoples. Um, do we have anybody collapsed in a barn sleeping? So Handy, yep, Handy's out. 
Miss P, you're now going to do Handy's job. Handy needs... How do I get you up? Handy, come over here and clean, and then cancel work. And what you doing? You're wandering. Miss P, you're going to go do her job, but you're right at your edge, too. We're all just kind of crashing. If I can just get them off to the edge of the map, they would then sleep, but they would be on their trip. Rabbit, you're wandering. Oh, I'm losing them. I'm losing them. <laughs> mm, minor break. Which one? Miss B. We're going to lose her. Uh-huh. Ah. Yeah. There definitely are flaws in this whole process. Need to be able to... Uh, to preload these things somehow. Both nights out sleeping in the rain. He's going to just... Have... You know, have really happy thoughts about that, I'm sure. Um, <laughs> okay, well, I guess we just let them all collapse for a little bit. Maybe we send them all in for one more meal. Maybe that would be the answer. Oath Knight needs... Yeah, let's let's do that. Come over here. You can sleep in the dining room. What do we have here? We have a stack of eight right now. So come on over. Reserve by ham. Okay, we'll go for a stack of ten right there. That one, handy. Same thing. One over here. Um, rabbit, whether you're working or not, come on over here. Consume a meal, and we'll just do this all over again. Consuming, and then we've got Miss P. You are gathering supplies, but you're going to fall asleep over there, and I need another meal in you before you hit that bar. So drop your supplies. Um, Alicia, you went to sleep with me already. Come on over here, do this. And Sea Stars, you you run out of food again. Come on over here and do this. And Oath Knight, I got you ready? I did. Okay, let's get the whole crowd over here. You can all bunk out in the dining room and disturb each other and get even more cranky. And then it'll be 10 o'clock the next day. And we can all leave and pretend that we're happy. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, Chanti goes down. Did he get food? He did. So that meal was so good, he just fell over. We're going to see that again. And Michael wasn't part of it. Sea Stars is wandering. Oath Knight is wandering. We've got an Alicia working her way in. And there's Miss B. I'm going to find Neil. Waiting to see who else is going to fall asleep on me. So there's Handy. She's, there's Rabbit over there. Come on in. Minor breaks. We've got Shantigo and Miss P. So Miss P is probably going to fall asleep too. Just need to get them going. Just need to get them going, which means a little more hay. Even the animals have given up. So we're really kind of stuck now. The animals are going to have to finish their sleep. So that's when we get to leave. So you guys may as well just go over here and camp out. As long as you don't camp out outside in the rain. Oh, oh, oh. Break down solar generator. Right there. Okay, somebody will get to that. Batteries are decent. I think they're going to be fine. So, um... One, two, three, four, five. Sea stars. Wandering. Six and seven. They're all here. One, two, three, four are asleep. They got their sleep disturbed. Rabbit, he's down. He's asleep. So I need Oath Knight and Sea Stars to, to crash on me. So go on in there, Oath Knight, and go to sleep. You're below your line. Boom, you're out. Sea stars, you're the only one that's iffy. And you're all going to be disturbed over and over and over. Yeah. That's just the way it is. Okay. <laughs> oh, the drama of of just uh, forming a caravan. Sea stars, when are you going to hit your line? Not for a little while yet. What is that line? 16. You're tired. You're so close. Now, Oath Knight, who's ruined you? You crash in Catherine's room. Of course. They, they're, they're buddies. They know each other. So, 
Daniel is filling up generators. Who else is doing what right now? We Actually, it's probably about time to start butchering. I'd say let's open up one of these. And unsuspend. And let's get some butchers going. We've got a little space in here. We've got a little space in here. Though we're going to be harvesting a bunch more food soon, aren't we? But we got all that in, thankfully. Uh, potatoes are at 92%, but there's not many. So how about strawberries? There's a few decent sized ones. 64%. Uh, potatoes over here look pretty close. 93%. So there's, no, there's not a lot of food that's ready to pop. What I really want to know is how quickly we're going to get at least the, uh, the rich soil areas. 28%. So that started probably the 6th or 7th of April, May when I opened these up to be uh, and maybe a little earlier than that. So hopefully that all comes in before all of this and our reserves start to, uh, start to run out. All right, so we've all been disturbed over and over and over again. Alicia needs disturbed four times or at negative six. We're going into cranky zone. We are... We're going to need another meal soon. Shantigo just woke up. That's all he could get without a bed, apparently. Okay, it doesn't give him the full rest. Little by little, we're going to start waking up. We're waiting for... Ah, oh, the animals are up. Okay, well, once... Who's our last... Now we've got this guy left. So once Muffalo 3 gets up and going, and Clyde, uh, make large sculpture is done. Oh, that's what we can do. That's right. Let's pause here for a second. What do we have here? We've got Wooden Large Sculpture Superior by Cyprian Beauty 200 called Isolation. This piece bears an image of a quickly moving cone of twisting air <laughs> carrying debris with it. All animal life has left the area. This scene takes place inside a settlement built near a forest. Eh? And the work is shaded in hues of gray and green. The artwork relates to Manuela's settlement being menaced by hostile weather. 1st of April, May, 5504. So, meaning this settlement or her hometown? Don't know, but that's interesting. Well, we've got to keep that one. Uh, Manuela. Now, she's already got the best room in the place. And she is very impressive bedroom, is happy about that. So we don't need to add any more to her room. So that one can go somewhere. Uh, excellent by Cyprian. 470 beauty. Woo! Marble. Freedom 7. This carving bears an illustration of a chicken huddled beside a mesa while covered in frost. Oh, another one of these. There is a mongoose <laughs> in the distance. While the graffiti-like style of the central scene clashes with the photographic depiction of the background. This depiction tells the story of the chicken getting hypothermia on 10th of December. -ary. I wonder if it's the same chicken that died on the 11th of December after that. <laughs> so, chicken. Yeah, we'll come up with a home for that one. We've got a Billy Beauty of 150, so just hit the bare minimum to qualify for, for keeping it, called Purple Rock. Made out of wood. Good. And bears an artwork of uncountable potatoes. The scene takes place inside a settlement near, built near a plane. The image somehow expresses both honesty and violence, being buried alive in potatoes. Um, we've got a Cyprian mirror with hugs, beauty of 200, large wooden sculpture, shaped like a village. The work suggests the concept of hostility. There's a mesa off to one side. This one, Billy, beauty of 350, wood, large wooden sculpture named... Billy's Peace. On this piece is an artwork of the minor celebrity Zachnar writing that was Klingon, right? Writing on a jackal wearing a shoe. <laughs> oh, where did they come up with these? There is a burrow behind the focal point while almost every shape in the image seems to be well balanced. <laughs> okay. Um, Cyprian's Beauty of 200 large wooden sculpture called Death Number 53. On this work is an illustration of Minla, Grandma. Okay, Grandma, polishing the surface of a sculpture. 
with a gleam in her eye. So Cyprian made a picture of Grandma making a, a sculpture. Cyprian really likes this theme, I tell you. Uncountable secretaries marvel at the device. And a zebra smiles beneath the main subject. You ever seen a zebra smile? The very static structure of the image almost conflicts with the sinuous style. The depiction tells the story of Grandma finishing construction on a sculpture. Grandma, what's your bedroom look like? Do you want to see yourself finishing a sculpture? You're over here. You're in blue. You have got nice blue carpeting, and you're at a 5.6. You're in good shape. So we can put that one some, some random place as well. Uh, over here, we've got... Ouvre. Seven. I'm sure that's French. Ouvre. Ouvre? Ouvre. I don't know. This carving by... Cyprian Beauty 150 bears a portrayal of Oath Knight, brutally disabling an alpaca with quick, efficient movements. Oath Knight is baring his teeth. If you squint your eyes, the unbalanced composition of the image reveals the outline of a deer. The work is infused with the idea of confinement and is done in a modern style. This image tells the story of harming the alpaca on 12th of December of last year. Yep, that one goes in Oath Knight's place. Install. He's down over here. He's got one little statue over there. This is going to be a centerpiece. Yeah, he'll, uh, he'll, 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 he'll put. you will find a place inside there to to mount Lucille when uh, when he's not out there uh, shooting things. Um, and then we've got. Where am I? One more. Right there, Billy. One fifty beauty, granite, large, good, sweat. Number 68, this carving bears an illustration of a caribou being knocked unconscious by Shantigo with an assault rifle with cold efficiency. Knocked unconscious. Hmm. Shantigo is baring his teeth. The scene seems to take place on the outskirts of a community and almost every shape in the image seems to be square. This artwork tells the story of knocking unconscious of the caribou. Oh, okay. Did I read caribou before? I don't know. Okay. By Shantigo. Okay. So, and Shantigo's room by now, I'm sure, is in pretty good shape, right? You're here? Yeah. No, you're only 4.3. You could use one more. Okay. So, turn you off. Hit the install. Bring you on over to... Right... Right there in that corner. All right. That takes care of that. I need Cyprian to... When you're done with that, please deliver this one. And deliver this one all right caravan are we up or not muffalo number three and up and clyde as soon as you guys wake up although i could get the other ones to continue loading right is there anybody who is up shantigo's up and he's wandering so he's not got the sense he needs to go deliver something so do we have a thousand uh gear hey is there 75 there Nothing there. Nothing there. We've got 450, so we're 520. I feel like I'm missing a muffalo. There you are. So 527, or 525, 725, 825, 875. There's 175 missing. Um, 175 missing. That could be on any one of us. There, Sea Stars, you got hay in your pocket? Handy? No. Alicia, I'll just have a fine meal. Some of you, at least. Oh, tonight. You got all the hay in your pocket? No. Do we wake you guys up? I kind of think we do. Do we wake you up by giving you another meal? Or do we just wake you up and get you on the road? We still have to wait for Clyde to wake up. But, uh, but I think it's time to get them going. It's just Clyde left. Okay, so in that case, Oath Knight, let's have you run up here and clean some dirt. Sure. Sea Stars, can you clean that dirt? And Handy, can you clean that dirt? Reserved by Sea Stars. Uh, if I do this, will it cancel? Nope, Sea Stars is up. So, Miss P, you can all clean the same dirt. That way, you'll all just get up. Sure. Oath Knight, why don't you work on that same dirt, too? And then that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So with that, I can cancel priority work and. I want to see you guys. Oh, there you go. With the, Clyde woke up. It's time to leave. Oh, it was exhausting. But they've all got some rest. They're all 
crankified. They're all half fed. Um, they're, they're grumbly, they're gripey, and they're all going on a nice, enjoyable road trip. Mm -hmm. Isn't that the way vacations usually start, anyway? You know, you, you set these unrealistic... Where you going? I said... I said south... Yeah. Did I not say southwest? I think I said southeast. I think I made a mistake. But we can go out this way anyway. All right, I was thinking this corner over here, and I think I put in this corner over here. But anyway, most road trips, you set unrealistic itineraries. You're going to do too many things in too little time. And if you get behind by an hour, the whole trip is ruined, and everybody's stressed out. That's just the way trips go. So here we are, a day and three hours later, we finally got the, uh, the car packed, and we're ready to take our trip. <laughs> Here, Miss B. So, Miss P is going to be our slowest. So I guess we're going to base our speed on her. Um, it was 0.6 days away to the the nearest place. Caravan is ready. So jump to location and we're going here. All right. So you're going there and what do I do? Split, settle. Do I tell you to go? I don't know. Okay, you form a caravan. Pause. You don't split, don't settle, but how do I tell you to go here? Right click? No. I don't know. I never told them where to go. Okay, back to this system not being very intuitive. I want you not to split and not to settle just to walk to there. But I can't drag and drop. I can't right click. Or can I? Did that just work? Click on you. That worked. Right click over there. Okay, so you should be on your way. Uh, stealthiness 0.9. No, if we want destination 0.3 days. Okay. Days of food 5.3. Rots in two days. We'll eat those up first. Uh, base movement time 1.23 hours per tile and current tile movement is 14 hours to get through an entire tile okay i think we're good let's pop out of this map world and minor break risk of bill who is harvesting hill root and what bill's terrible ugly environment and he locks lacks a body part why don't you come over and just get yourself a nice hot meal and and get out of the rain and, and stop being so cranky Michael, George, I need somebody up here who can actually clean. Diamond, where are you at? You're not nearby. Grandma's over there. Bliss. You were in the process of playing billiards. You really need it. You really do. Yeah. So, Diamond, where are you at? You are over here cleaning rock rubble. Um, yeah, this kitchen is atrocious. Can I get you in here? Actually start there and hit this one as a backup. Actually get up in there, too. And then wander your way through to here and kind of hit over there and a little bit over here. And we're allowing butchering to continue now, so we better get the the, uh, the butcher's lab over here cleaned up. And now that those have left the map, I remember right now, this is now no longer Sea Star's bed. Yeah, all the bedrooms are, are unclaimed. Hmm, okay. I see a lot of dirty bedrooms. Need to get that done, too. I probably need to... How about our artists? Why don't you guys work on uh, doing some house cleaning for me? You've had a lot of fun making your art, but let's give you something a little more productive to do as far as keeping everybody's moods up. So, Cyprian, you are going to go to cleaning for a while. And Billy, will you clean? Billy won't clean. Aha, uh -huh. he will haul though. Yeah. A wild boar is pregnant. Billy, you can go hauling. Although you were making. No, it was Bill that was making medicine. Bill, where are you at right now? Right there. You are eating a meal, needs. And. How is the medicine looking? Nutrimine 128. Why don't you. Why did why did it not let me do that? Because we've hit our, our limit. We hit 150. Okay, 
then we won't worry about it. Um, otherwise, things to do. You guys are making fine meals? Fine meals. Fine meals are at what point right now? Where am I? Right there. 115. What did we set those for? It was 115 or 125. Wild boar is pregnant. <clears throat> 150. Ah, we sent that through the roof, trying to get this stuff used up. That's what it was. Okay, so Diamond's got all, that all cleaned up. Um, any more to do right there? Yep, you got it done. You're heading down, you're going to do the kitchen over again. You missed a few spots. No, you're consuming a fine meal, but you'll be near the kitchen, so that'll still work. Um, Cyprian, you are where right now? You're, boy, this list is short. Cyprian, right there. Cleaning dirt. Let's give you some specific tasks. Then I want to go check on our caravan. Come on over here and do this one. Just kind of roll you down the room here. What is that? That's just an interesting uh, uh, graphic there. Do that one. Do that one. Okay, walking up this side. All these look pretty good. Good there. Grandma's sleeping. Um, could use something right there. Uh, your needs, you're fine. No complaining. Right through there looks fine. Natalia's sleeping. It is 1800. Should be getting up soon. We'll go ahead and set that one. Down over here. Is that dirt there? That's not. Although there is... Nope, just looks like it. Okay, you're fine. Over in here, I noticed that David was sleeping in dirt, but somebody's walked in there and cleaned it anyway. So that's okay. Over here, we got some over here in Eric's room. We'll get that one done. And I know I saw a bunch over here in Billy's room. That's not... Yeah, no, I, I... There it is. That works, yeah. So that's all the bedrooms. Nope, we've got one more. There... And this bedroom I always miss right here is looking pretty good. Okay, that takes care of all that. Is it going to rain forever? It's been raining for the last three episodes. Hmm, nobody got to this one. That's kind of surprising. Venison is rotten away in storage. Must be in here. Temperature in here is 39 indoors. You are set for 16. Really? 39? In here? 36. How warm is it out there? It's 62. Why are these... Are we just moving in and out of here too much? Let's think about this. We're trapped. Oh, it's 171 degrees in there. Ooh, we're, maybe there's a point at which we no longer pull heat out of these guys. In real life, that would be the case. It would You wouldn't be able to dump heat any further in you know, refrigeration. Let's deconstruct that. Let's get somebody to do that immediately. Diamond. Cathra. Deconstruct. I need construction skills. Diamond, you were an eight. Yeah, I thought you had some. So go over here and do this immediately. Break that one. I'm curious to see if there is a problem. Power use high. Set for 16. But in here, it's 36. So tear that apart. <clears throat> 36. Let's see if we suddenly see these things start to work again. So it says we're, we're working. 35. So this right now is outdoors. Are you going to drop to 34? I mean, 34. I'm thinking that has something to do with it. So all the stuff was, was kind of rotting on us. Oh, you spoil in eight days. You spoil in a quandrum in three days. Caravan has arrived at its destination already. So... I don't want to settle, right? I want to handy? No. Okay. Settle in this area. Colonists will enter this area and you'll be able to start building a new home. I guess we settle, then we abandon? Last time we went for an existing town, so we didn't have to think about this. We just got there and, and traded and came back. I guess we settle. Cannot be adjacent to each other. Oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> Rimworld. 
So I've got to go out to here, which adds two more days travel time. Is that what you're telling me? Handy health. Okay. Needs. Food. Okay. It's 20 hundred. You guys are all going to go to sleep soon. <sighs> wow. Okay, so we're paused. Right? World? We're paused. Okay. Let's do this. You to here is 0.9 days. Let's get rid of that. Remove. You back to here afterward is 1.8 days. So that just cut down our our available time by having to go two squares over. I never realized that I couldn't just mine in the next square. I wasn't thinking of settling. So am I missing something? Tell you what, I'm going to pause the game here. We're at about 40 minutes anyway. Let's pause it here. If you guys know how I can drop into the very next tile and mine some, some components out of there, let me know. If I have to go all the way to there, we're only going to get to stay there for a day. And then we got to turn right around and come back. So, yeah. Let me know what your thoughts are on this. Um, add remove waypoints. Let's, let me cancel all of that. And again, I'm there. I can settle or I can split and go off in another direction. I don't see any other choices. Handy <clears throat> items. That's the whole caravan. Social. So handy social and colonists. What we have, um, we're dealing with. Oh, handy. Okay. I'm just going through any other options that I may have missed. What everybody's carrying and wearing and whatnot. That's gear, needs. Here's their rest, their food, their moods, including the animals, and health. What we know about everybody. Weakened moving. Weakened manipulation. And muffalo weakened moving. Oh, late stage pregnant. Oh, didn't think about that. We may be coming back with four muffalos. Um, so with that, I assume we have to settle, which means we have to go out by one more, which means we have to get back in time before we run out of food. Yeah, no problem. So let me know what you think about all that, and I'll catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.